Okay, Royals, today in the pot, we have about a pound of ground turkey for our chili. We're going to season it with onion powder, garlic powder. So, I don't use measurements, but season it to your taste. Onion powder, garlic powder. We're going to get some black pepper going in there. Again, as much as you like. We like a lot of flavor over here. Also going to add a little dry parsley. Just a little because we're going to add some fresh parsley later. And last but certainly not least, Cajun Queen seasoning. Salt-free Creole seasoning can only enhance your meals so you can use as much as you want don't be stingy with it and for your meat for your chili you can use ground beef we are using ground turkey so be back in a minute so you just let it brown for about five to ten minutes don't want to overcook it because it's still going to cook in the chili sauce Meat has browned enough. Now we're going to transfer it to the strainer and start on the veggies. Alrighty, so in the same pot with the meat drippings, we have about a half a stick of margarine. If you want to use butter, EVOO, that works. Then we're going to add our veggies. About half of a red bell pepper, half of a green one, um, one small yellow onion, and about five cloves of garlic. And we're going to let that just get nice and translucent alrighty so you just cook your vegetables about on a medium for about two to three minutes and then we're going to start adding in the layers be back all right they've cooked down a little bit we're going to go ahead and add the meat back in and some recipes calls for tomato sauce or tomatoes. I don't like tomatoes, but we're going to put some rotel tomatoes in with the juice. Two cans. Okay, the rotel tomatoes are in there. And then I'm going to add about a cup of broth. You can use beef broth. I'm using chicken broth. You can use vegetable broth. Whatever you like. And we're going to turn the heat up to about medium high and let this cook. Now that everything is in, we're going to go ahead and add chili powder. Can't be chili without chili powder. You can use the pack. You can have your chili powder however you like. And as much as you like. Okay. Okay, now that everything is nearing with chili without chili beans so and we're gonna pour in our chili beans be right back all right like i said i seasoned a layer so i added some more garlic powder onion powder black pepper same seasoning from the beginning and of course some more cajun queen seasoning and we're gonna let this cook down for about 20 minutes and then serve okay it's been stewing for about 10 minutes remember I told you guys we're gonna put some fresh parsley just for the last 10 minutes give it that freshness airy taste okay let's mix this up okay take a look at there you see some of all of those good vegetables, the meat, the beans. Yes. My semi-homemade chili. Remember, you do what you want to do with yours. So, I'm going to let this cook down for maybe about five to eight more minutes. And then, we're going to put it in a bowl and put our toppings. Okay, here's the end result. Doesn't that look delicious? And you can top it with whatever. I just use a little cheese, some fried onion, and a little fresh onion. I don't do the sour cream, but the steam. Look at it. Yummy, yummy, yummy. All right. Till next time.